All right, let's get started. Welcome to the session on design patterns in the light of Lambda expressions. My name is Venkat Subramaniam. We're going to talk about design patterns, but we're going to talk about how Lambdas actually change patterns and how we use them. Well, I want to first start out by saying that I really hate design patterns. That was very motivating, wasn't it? Well, I'll tell you why I actually hate patterns. We often tend to really want to use patterns very quickly. And if you really think about it, how do we really figure out what patterns to actually use? Well, I want to say, if you really think about it, we all can agree that grandma makes the best pie. So you've been telling about grandma's pie to your friends, and your friends say, well, if grandma's pie is so good, why don't you make it? So you call grandma and say, grandma, I've been talking about your pie all along. I want a recipe. I want to make it for my friends. So grandma gives you the recipe for, uh, for the pie. And you write it down. And as you're writing down, grandma says, you know, add two uh, spoons of sugar. You say, wait, 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 is it tablespoons or teaspoon? You ask for all these details. And then once all, the, all that is done, what do you do? You say, grandma, let me go over this one more time, and what are the best practices? Well, after that, you make the pie, and how did it turn out to be? A disaster, wasn't it? The last time I tried this, I lost the spoon with it. So the point is, that didn't work at all. Then you finally meet grandma and say, grandma, that was a disaster. And grandma says, Let me, let's make pie together. And you're, and you're watching grandma make pie and while grandma is telling you stories. And then grandma wants to add sugar. What does grandma do? Grandma takes two spoons of sugar, measures it accurately, and puts it right. No. Grandma, while talking, takes some sugar and tosses it in. And you said, wait, what was that? Sugar. How much did you put? Enough. And that's when you realize grandma never follows the recipe she gave you. Well, the guys who wrote the design patterns book are the grandmas and grandpas of industry. And the worst thing they ever did in, the, did in their life is write the damn book. And now everybody thinks, right, we can actually do this and wow, I can use patterns too. So it actually takes years of experience and making mistakes to learn use of patterns. So having said that, if we do decide to use a pattern, I often use a pattern as a way to communicate rather than as a design tool. And of course, it can be very easy to communicate and say, well, I'm using this factory method here. I'm using the abstract factory here or a decorator here. It can be a nice communication.